From this video, I would like to explain the construction of a rectangle flag with sides FL is equal to 6 cm and LA is equal to 4.2 cm. This is from exercise 3.4 from 8th class of AP and Telangana State Boards. Hi, this is Madhubabu. The construction is construct a rectangle flag with sides FL is equal to 6 cm and LA is equal to 4.5 cm. This is a rectangle is a quadrilateral. To construct a quadrilateral, we need 5 measurements, but here only 2 measurements are given. So, let us go to analysis. First rectangle, draw a rectangle diagram. This is the rough diagram, flag, this is a flag, in a rectangle pair of opposite sides are equal, so analysis, first one, the pair of opposite sides are equal, so FL is equal to the opposite side of FL is GA that is equal both will be same that is given measurement that is 6 centimeters and so 6 centimeters 6 centimeters and LA is equals to 4.2 centimeters so pair of opposite side of LA is FG so it will be 4.2 centimeters so LA is equals to FG is equals to 4.2 centimeters next property is all angles are right angles right angles means each one 90 degrees so angle F is equal to angle L is equal to angle A is equal to angle T is equal to all are equals to 90 degrees. So this is the analysis. So now we got all the sides and all the angles. So now let us go to the construct a rectangle flag original diagram. Dry line segment. FL that is equals to 6 centimeters. Now we have to construct an angle 90 degrees at F or at L. I preferred at L construct 90 degrees. 90 degrees is a standard angle. So we can construct this 90 degrees without, without using protractor. Standard angles we can construct without using protractor also that's why they are called standard angles so take some radius no need to measure this one take some radius with compass you can take like this take LA as center with this radius draw an arc Till ending the construction of 90 degrees, it should not be moved. That means the measurement will not be changed. So, with the same measurement, with this same measurement, from the intersecting point of this side and the arc as a center, draw another arc which cuts the arc. So, this indicates 60 degrees from 60 degrees draw another arc this indicates 120 degrees now 90 degrees lies between 60 and 120 degrees so from 60 degrees again draw an arc At 120 degrees, 
draw another arc from L from L through this intersecting point through this intersecting point you draw a ray that is LX now LX making an angle 90 degrees with FL we can check by protracted so here this is exactly 90 degrees so what we did is correct next LA is equals to 4.2 centimeters LA is equals to 4.2 centimeters so take 4.2 centimeters radius with compass 4.2 centimeters 4 4.1 4.2 take l as the center this 4.2 cm as the radius draw an arc draw an arc which cuts LX at A so the intersecting point of this arc and the ray is A so the length of LA is 4.2 centimeters 4.2 centimeters now the length of FG by analysis that is 4.2 centimeters so again take 4.2 centimeters radius with compass take F as the center this 4.2 centimeters as radius draw an arc and AG length AG length is 6 cm so take 6 cm radius with compass take 6 cm radius with compass now take A as center this 6 cm as radius draw an arc so the both arcs intersect at G so keep the vertex G now you join FG and AG and mark the measurements AG is 6 cm and FG is 4.2 cm so this is the required rectangle flag so the construction is completed next steps of construction first one is Draw a line segment FL is equal to 6 cm. Second step, draw a ray LX making an angle 90 degrees with LF. Next one, take L as center 4.2 cm as radius, draw an arc. This arc cuts LX at A so it cuts LX at A now take F as center 4.2 cm as radius draw an arc 
and in this step only take a as center 6 cm as radius draw an arc they intersect at g next step is join fg and ag therefore the required rectangle flag is constructed so the problem of this construction is completed if you like this video please like it and share it to those who read math basics and subscribe this channel